This is going to be ridiculous. With what? I don't even know how to properly start this video. These questions, Mope, I, I don't know if you're ready for them. I'll be fine. We have... Alright, so... Typical Battlefleet and chill type deal and everything, you know, but... One person went and took their stupid well and beyond anything that I've ever expected. Now, I've seen the failures of Zinch. I've, I've seen the gardens of Nurgle. But I have never seen anything this disgustingly stupid before in my life. I looked at a few of these questions. There's about uh, like 200 in this list, I believe. I'm not 100% no. on that. One second. Oh. How, how are we going to answer all of those? 256 questions. Yeah. So, this whole episode of um, Battlefleet and Chill is going to be constantly being asked by these questions. And it is just going to be hilarious. But before we begin, me and Mopa are going to be doing a couple of rounds of Battlefleet Gothic. And in the meantime, if you guys want to ask your own ridiculous questions, please use the Super Chat feature. It goes a long way to supporting the channel, and it really helps me out. Thank you. You guys know I love you. And if you want to donate $5, you can play a game against me and Mope or me. Um, we're still trying to figure out how to play just against Mope while being on my stream. We'll figure that one out in the near future. So, Mope. You have Battlefleet up? I do. I'm waiting for your invite. All right. This, I, I don't have words for this. So let's just jump right into this. Why not? Let's get the first question. What is your favorite flavor of ice cream? Oh, okay. That's a mint chocolate chip. Are you ready for a horrible, horrible start? I don't like ice cream. Oh no! What? How do you not like ice cream? I don't know, I just don't. Huh. It's too sweet, I don't like the texture of it. Wow, Mope, we can't be friends anymore. I know! See, that just did it. That That's where I draw the line, Mope. I really never wanted to tell you. I was hoping to just keep it a secret. You are a keeper of secrets. True. <laughs> All right, let's get the second question. Best kind of chocolate. Solid chocolate, so not stuff. Oh, wait. Solid chocolate, so no stuff besides regular chocolate. Mmm. I, I, um... I like Milky Ways, and I like Nestle's Crunch, so I'd say Nestle's chocolate is the best. Milk chocolate, all the way. Alexis, it's just gonna get worse. I have, I have even worse news to tell you than the last one. I hate you, Mope! I don't like chocolate. Of course you don't like chocolate! <laughs> I never wanted to tell you. I'm so sorry. Uh, are you even real, Mope? Um, well, that depends on what you consider real. Is the warp real? Oh, okay, fair enough. Okay, let's try to get a question that Mope can actually answer. Oh, uh, let's toss this guy down, why not? And just have you auto. Here's, here's one. Oh, I would also like to state that the person that did this, I'm pretty sure he did this just to spite me, it's all in Comic Sam. <laughs> Alright, what's the question? What, in your opinion, is the worst city in the United States? The worst city in the United States. Um, I don't know too many cities outside of New York, but I'd probably say Syracuse. We'll follow your command. Um, that's in New York. It has a really high crime rate, and it's kind of tiny. For the dark so house. yeah, I'm gonna say LA. Nothing against LA, except your, your traffic. It's just. I would rather, I would rather do anything than drive in LA traffic. 
Did you see what we're actually fighting? Uh, no, I did not. Yeah, whatever. I'm just gonna charge straight ahead at them. All right, what do we got for the next one? If you were given infinite funds to travel the world, where would be the first place you go? First place I would go. Um. Probably, um. Probably Australia. We have sighted an enemy ship. I would pick Sweden. Oh, you just went. <laughs> no, I'm not gonna say because Pri will get mad at me. <laughs> no, I generally have Swedish ancestry. Genuinely. We've lost an escort ship. I would also pick Australia. I, yeah, Australia is just it's too cool. Like I mean, yeah, you could you could just walk out and die. I mean, Iceland's a pretty obvious choice, but I, I didn't want to say it. So I'm kind of going there anyway. Ooh, good shot with those torpedoes. I'm getting a good shot with the torpedoes, but they're tearing my battle cruiser apart. Moving to those coordinates. They are. Here, let me uh, prioritize some of these ships. Alright, what do we got next? We are Just, um, what would you consider the ample, uh, the ample amount of people that turns a gathering into a party slash, slash shindig slash hoedown? That is a ton. Oh, that guy outmaneuvered me, the asshole. I'm gonna say, uh, eight. I would say six. Really? Six is a good number for a shindig. Well, oh, oh, I thought we were asking how many it is when it changes from, like, a hangout to a party. Uh, yes. No, I'd still say six. I'm gonna ram this eight. ship. Like, I am, I am hell-bent on ramming this one ship. You're gonna get rammed. Oh, this ship's about to die. Yeah, you're fucked. That's not good. Yep, it died. Your orders. It's okay. Their ship is about to die too. I rammed it! Good job. Retros activated. Out of my way, ship. We'll follow your command for now. I had to do that. Um oh we got a we bunch for your souls. bunch of enemy ships still left. That's not good. Yeah, right. the, the, we're not doing too great this one. You know what? We're, we are... We are distracted by the whispers of Slanesh. What is the it next happened. question that we got? What do you think is the most important amendment in the United States? First Amendment. No. Second Amendment. Second. Wait, which one? I always get the first second and second. Second Amendment is the right to bear arms. I'm gonna say the first. Okay, that's free speech. Yeah. Free speech okay. is just way too important. I'd say Second Amendment because without the Second Amendment, we can't protect ourselves and we can't protect our free speech. That is true. Cruising speed set. All right, that was a that was a pretty that was a political question, but that's fine. I mean, yeah. All right, what do we got next? Cruising speed set. Who would you want to be an actor? Who would you want to be an actor to play you in a movie about your life? I won't lie, I don't know the names of any actors or actresses. I'm a ramet. Good job. And when I think about it, the only person who I think that could represent me and could play me in a way that I would find satisfactory would probably be Aubrey Plaza. Mope, I could play you perfectly. That's true. You could. But that's just a joke, obviously. We are but yeah, my choice would be Aubrey Plaza. I rammed two ships to death, just letting you know, Mope. Good job. I think we're actually gonna win. Check it out, we only have one ship left. Yeah, we won this one. Oh, and you got him into stasis. Just gonna make sure they can't escape. We'll okay, uh, next question. Oop. In Warhammer 40k, what is your favorite Xenos fact? Uh, crew. For chaos comes, 
I really, really, really like the crew. I'm a ram it, Mope. Or Galdar. Mope, I'm gonna ram it. Are you really? Yeah, I'm gonna try to ram him. Go for it. But yeah, my favorite Xenos would be Dark Eldar. We are unstoppable! Come on. Forward to the slaughter! Adjusting rotation! No, you killed No, I still got the ram! You killed them, but I got the ram in. You did it, Alexis. Hmm. No, I just really like the crew. It, it's just the the whole Native American aspect of them that I really like. I love the... I actually really like Native American culture, so... Really? I can understand that. Native American culture is pretty... It's well, really interesting. There's two cultures that I, I really, really... No, three cultures that I really, really, really like. Um, the first being the Zulu Nation. I really love uh, Zulu. I can see that. That's a really good one. I find then, it fascinating how they was able to organize that army with just running. Mm-hmm. And then I like uh, Native Americans. Uh, I'm not going to pick a specific uh, tribe or whatever, because I kind of just like their overall um, aesthetic. Okay. Uh, there is a local tribe that I, I've been trying to learn more about, but a lot of the things up here are misinformation or tourist attractions, so it's, it's kind of... Really? It's, yeah, because... In, uh, I'm in central slash upstate New York. Yeah. So it's one of those things where it's like, yeah, this is what Native Americans did. It's just like, they didn't do any of this. How I want to actually learn about them. And it's just, yeah. There are actually, like at my universities, there are some natives that teach. And then there are tons of natives down in the capital. Um, <clears throat> you'll have more than enough. Op There's actually like a Native American cultural center at my university. Okay, that like, I really like. Yeah, there. Well, it's because there are a lot of them here. There are tons of different tribes too. Um, the two that I've known the most of is Salt River, was down in Phoenix, and then Navajo up here. There's one other that's up here in the Flagstaff Grand Canyon area that I'm that I'm uh, that's slipping my mind. Besides Navajo, and I can't remember. Mm-hmm. What was your third? Oh, my third is uh, ancient Egypt. During the, uh, the, uh, specifically when Osiris was the main, uh, god at the time. I can't remember the exact time period, so forgive me. That's okay. And I, I just like Zulu. Like, the dude is awesome. And he had Kapingas. I really like Kapingas. I think those are fantastic. Oh, those are such freaking fantastic choices. I like all three of them. Egypt is so cool. I freaking love pyramids. <laughs> What was the question again? Um, yeah. How did we get talking about what cultures you liked, Alexis? I'm honestly oh. not even sure anymore. Oh, because you started talking about the crew. The question was in Warhammer 40k, what is your favorite Xenos faction? Oh, I yeah. take that in a weird angle. Mine was just Dark Eldar because they torture and enslave people. Way to be boring, Mope. All right, uh, we do have a super chat, so if you want to get to that really quickly. Would you rather kill, maim, or purge? Oh. Mope, forgive me. Okay. My heart is still with the Imperium. Purge. Not me who you have to ask for forgiveness. Only Slanesh. All right. Wait, what were my choices again? Burn, kill. No, kill, maim, or purge. Kill, maim, or purge. I'm gonna go with maim. Yeah, that's Slaneshi. Alright, what's the next question on that list? If you could travel to one planet and live there for a week, where would you go? Nowhere, I would die. But I'm gonna stick this to being 40k related. And I'm gonna say the planet of Trevoska. And I'm going to pronounce it that way just to annoy Viggy, who's going to listen to this later. I'd go with a Crone World. Ooh, Crone World is a good choice. I'd hang out with some demons. And some Eldar. There's only one good yes. thing from Kvoska, and he has a crappy excuse for a pig leg. <laughs> Moving 
moving to those coordinates. All right. So we got nine enemy ships. I'm assuming orcs. Slaughter them. Seems like a fair assumption to me. Come on, me. I'm gonna put out some uh, defenders, and then we're gonna go flying out. Uh, all right. Next question. What is your favorite restaurant? Uh, okay, so now I get to sound like a really cheap bitch. I kind of just like name, insert name here, Italian restaurant. I really like Italian food. Did we both take it, our biggest ship? There's this restaurant down in Mesa in Phoenix called Bavarian Point. They have German food. That is by far my favorite restaurant. We have sighted an enemy ship. Oh, fighting Eldar. Let's see what we got. We have sighted an enemy ship. All right, I'm gonna try to take do take on their biggest ones really quickly. Okay, there's one running around the gas cloud. I'm gonna see what's there. Slaughter. Okay. We have sighted an enemy ship. Next question. Have you ever completed a first aid class? And are you first aid certified? I am first aid certified. I'm a registered EMT until... Actually, I think that's up. I don't think I am anymore. Oh, this ship is screwed. I have never taken any sort of first aid. Yeah, I'm first aid certified. At least for now. I'm not. Oh man, I'm so screwed. Why did you go through getting first aid certified? Uh, I worked with the New York Department of Health and I took care of people with developmental disabilities for quite some time. Okay, that makes sense. So it was just something that I had to get. Nick Bush? Yep. Mechanicum or dark and yeah. Mechanicum or dark mechanicum. Who do you like more? A dark mechanicum. The mechanicum. Mechanic yeah, the mechanicum itself is just too. Uh, it's just too religious for me. I don't really like either, but if I have to pick one, I'm gonna pick the chaos one. This guy outmaneuvered the shit out of me. That'll happen, they are elves. Yeah, they're just dancing around my freaking ship. This ship is too damaged. I'm gonna have this ship run. Okay. And I, if I could just connect with a ram, that ship would- Oh, my ship died. Aww. Okay. It is what it is. Next question. It happens. Next question. Uh, whatever. Next question. Hey. Next question. Who's your favorite actor? Um. Just show us something to kill. Oh, we won. For chaos comes. Good job. Yeah, I both of our battleships are like in perfect condition. Yeah, they are. Um, I don't really have a favorite actor. I mean, I liked Will Smith when he wasn't terrible at movies. I pick Russell Crowe. Russell Crowe is fantastic. Or he was. These last couple of movies he'd done haven't been that great. The um, Gladiator and Cinderella Man was fantastic. Let's see. I mean, I... I want to say William, uh, William Neeson. Really That's like him. Hmm. Yeah, it's it's a tough call. God. All right, my big ship can get an upgrade. Um, let me actually up your warp talons first. And. Let's go ahead and get this up first. Oh, also, Nubal, if you see any cool comments just in the comment section 
uh, in the comments as they go by. Because uh, I saw mm -hmm. one from Evil Ash. Uh... Alexis, that is awesome that you help people with disabilities. Bless you. From someone whose son is on the autism spectrum and has ADHD. I just... I had to help. Like... I'm I'm a I'm a person that I'm stubborn and I'm egotistical, I'm not gonna lie. But I like to help people. <laughs> um we got we got a Well give me a second to pull up the thingy. Um Nubal, you can't be pulling up your thingy on live stream. <laughs> I'm not sorry. Okay. All right. This next question is from the legendary Mega Prime or Captain John. No stuff. Steal a ship. Crash head. Crash head. Man, okay, we, we get it. Smashing. We get it. Get the get to the question. Get to the question. Okay. He asked me to. He asked me to say it. <laughs> if an orc ship explodes, but you don't find the captain's body, is he dead? The answer is no. I want to. I want to scrap you, grot loving pansy. All right, Captain. All right. Looks like I got a challenge, Mope. So after this game, I'm gonna I'm gonna battle the Mega Captain again. Sounds good to me. Makes Slanesh proud. Oh, do I battle him with the Slaneshi fleet? I honestly think without your assistance, my Slanesh fleet just cannot handle him. You might be right. I am almost a hundred percent sure that I can't. Alright, alright. Uh, next, um... Next crazy question. Let's get some crazier ones in here. I like these. Alright, uh... Cats or dogs? Dogs. Cats. Uh, Mo, really? What? I hate you. We are on What? Such a bitch. It's just cats versus dogs. We'll follow your command. Okay, okay look, 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 look. The only dog First? I like is a Pomeranian, and I think everyone agrees that isn't even a dog anymore. Okay. First? First? I'm half tempted to ram your ship. I'm not going to, but I am tempted. First is the ice cream, then it's the chocolate, now you like the wrong animal. Tremble. I know. Comes. And for anybody wondering, I am obviously joking. All right, what's the next one? I'm gonna skip a couple because you said you wanted a crazy one. Here's one. Do you enjoy the works of Danny DeVito? Who is Danny DeVito? You told me who Danny DeVito. Isn't he He's the a really uh, short comedian? He's an um. Isn't he an Aladdin? I don't think so. I think that's Robin Williams. Yeah, so. No, 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 the parrot. No, that Donnie, that... no, that's not Donnie DeVito. That's Gilbert Godfrey. Oh, okay, yeah. that's what I was thinking. By the way, Danny I'm still DeVito running. is Matilda. He was the dad in that. Okay, he also gotcha, is gotcha. in Everything Sunny in Philadelphia. Oh, I don't know who... I'm sorry, I just don't know who that is. I'm sure you do. You can, I'm sure you do. By the way, Mope, I'm still ramming ships. Yeah, you are. You should probably play Imperium when you fight the orcs. Yeah, I'm gonna. Next question? Yep. How much have you spent on Steam games? Not much, actually. I have 385 games on my Steam uh, between me and a shared uh, account that we use. And I don't think that I've actually spent too, too much. We come for your souls. I don't have a lot of games, but you one of the games I do have is Crusader Kings. And I have all the expansion packs for it, so I've spent a lot. We'll follow your command for now. Okay. Let's get this, let's keep these rolling. Also, everybody, right. if you would like to donate, you can ask your question right now, and I would really like some ridiculous questions. I think they're funny. 
All the donations go towards helping the channel, so shameless plug done. Okay, go. Okay. Uh, have you ever been addicted to a video game before? Addicted? I would say no. I've played it a lot, but not addicted. I am still addicted to the original World of Warcraft. No, but you have a you have an addictive personality. I do. It's true. I can't resist anything. If I have a desire, I give in. Yeah, that ship's gonna ram you. Oh, it's come on, come on. Cruising speed set. Oh god, I have to find a certain question. He's asking me to find it for you. Set engines to full ahead. <laughs> Forward to the slaughter. Why is ramming so much fun? Cruising speed set. Mop, I don't know what you complain about with these ships. I think they're perfect for ramming. Well, that one is because it's gigantic. Ah, note to self, get the gigantic ones. They're good at <laughs> ramming. Also, the AI never rams. Yeah, which is kind of a shame, except for the orcs. Right, they're the only ones that do. When it's like the Imperium should do that more. They should play like me. Cruising speed set. Mope, I'm a ram it. I'm a ram it. Are you sure you want to do that? Yes. Once my ship turns, I'm a ram it. Here we go. No, don't you run. Okay, I'm gonna ram it. I'm gonna run. I'm gonna ram it. Here it goes. Here it goes. I like this. You <laughs> crazy. You crazy. <laughs> ah, that's just so much fun. <sighs> you ready for this next question? Sure. Are coconuts mammals due to the fact that they are covered with hair and don't lay eggs? <laughs> Wait, repeat that? Oh, oh god, everything's missing up. One second. Are coconuts, are coconuts mammals because they have hair and don't lay eggs? Yes. Uh... Well, we do have a botanist with us. Your droops. Say. That's it. <laughs> they're fruit. They're droops. Sorry. They're droops. We got the answer. They are droops. We are all droop. <laughs> okay, so now I'm going to go ahead and kick Mope and invite a certain mega captain. Next, next question. <laughs> um, Mope, can you pull him into the admin, well, into the chat so that we can, uh, so I can get him, so I can beat this orc's butt. I'm also actually I to... actually don't see him. In... Yeah, he's not on the server. One second, I'll message him. Okay, I'm going to go back and I'm going to switch. Oh, no, fleets. we got him. Here he is. Here's that orc. Okay, I just have to switch fleets really quickly because there's no goddamn way that my my chaos fleet could ever handle uh knight's fleet <laughs> okay oh. the imperial fleet is ready oh uh we got a super chat one with a ask that real quick yes if you were arrested with no explanation what would your friends and families assume you had done beating the shit out of somebody <laughs> I'm not going to say that I've not been arrested for that. Yeah, I can see it. Either that or reckless driving. Um, yeah, just those two. What about you, Mope? What what uh what uh safe for work things uh would would you get arrested for? <laughs> What safe for work things could I get arrested for? Hmm. I actually once got in trouble for yelling at someone in public, and then I've gotten in trouble for threatening people over the phone. 
Hmm. Yeah. That's not. Oh, that's a whole lot of nothing happening. Gork I was or more for something else, like probably like accidentally forgetting to like update my license plate or something. Uh oh, something's not working. Hey, <laughs> your sparky bit's not working, Orc. My sparky bit's not working. These I'm clicking it. Clicking the buttons and it's not going nowhere. Alright, uh, let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Gork or Mork? I have to go with Gork. No, wait, no. Mork? Mork, Mork is the, uh, Mork is the tech one, right? Is cunning but brutal. Yeah, he's the tech one. I would go with, I would go with Mork. I, the way I played my orcs was it was cannons everywhere and it was a tech heavy list. So, it was always mechanized. I really like Mork. What about you, Mope? Mm. Are you gonna spite me? I know you're gonna spite me. I can feel it. I can feel it. Right I'll take you cares. Um, you're not here yet. He's not. I'm. I'm saying I'm gonna, yeah. go. I'm gonna go with Mork. Yeah, yep. we agree on something. The yep. more uh, sneaky one, right? Mm-hmm. Yes. Yeah, I'll go with Mork. I'm clicking the join game. Ain't nothing happening. All right, invite me to yours. Oh lord. Okay. Yeah, I prefer cunning but brutal. <laughs> I am the Fist of Mork. Alright, what's the next crazy question? Um, one second. I was about to mess with somebody. Because they are uh, super chat. So, mm -hmm. um, would you enjoy an alien remake where Sigourney Weaver attacks a group of helpless xenomorphs? Yes. <laughs> I think Sigourney yes. Weaver is too old. Yes, I would. I would like that. Okay, all right, I like that, I like that, I like that. All right, what's the next one? What's the next one? What there object would... What object when left in a running refrigerator for 25 years would be the furriest? What, what? What, what, what object when left, when left in a refrigerator for 25 years would be the furriest? I'm gonna go with potato. I have no idea. Squeak. Hmm. I'm gonna say... I'm really not sure there. How about a or, mouse? Or an orange. An orange would probably get pretty furry. I guess if you got a fruit, it would get covered in like that weird fuzz. Yeah. Kiwi. I mean, we could throw a uh, Nubal in there. He's a furry. <laughs> oh, there you go. There's the answer. It's Space Wolves. Yeah, it's um, the Space Wolves. Why am I reading this question? Because <laughs> you enjoy the pain. This is true. Wait, where the bloody hell is my big ship? What? Uh oh. Is this one? Yep. What is your favorite fun fact? Um. <laughs> okay, alright, alright. Let me, let me explain this one perfectly. So I saw this as a meme on the internet and it to this day makes me laugh my ass off, okay? So there was this thing that just said, fun fact, uh, or no, it was a did you know, but it, I still count that as a fun fact. It said, did you know that the lion can jump 25 feet in the air? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> and it just shows the lion, like, a giraffe's end ends, like, right here, and the lion's, like, way up here. <laughs> what? And to this day, it kills me! <laughs> okay, <laughs> okay, that's my job. Oh my god. <sighs> I'm sorry, that, that, uh, that gets to me. That really gets to me. I find it to be the funniest goddamn thing in the world. Um, I think that was so funny that, yeah, I, I had forgotten about that. I'm going to go with that being my favorite fun fact, too, because whatever I was going to say was lame in comparison. Probably. Freaking lions jumping 25 feet in the air. It's so ridiculous. <laughs> Just 25 feet straight up in the air. <laughs> Like, they meant to say, like, leap, like, it can run and jump, and right. go ahead and do a long jump 25 foot. 
But, but no. No. Lions jumping up to the third, to the second story of building. No, that would be the third story. Yeah. It'd be ridiculous. Burn retros. Sure, no, just talking about the lion. Huh. Ship ready. What's the opposite of a koala? Panda. Your orders. Panda. Oh, wrong. It's a lark. I was gonna say a pigeon. <laughs> you were gonna say a pigeon? <laughs> Cruising speed set. <laughs> pigeon. No, I don't know about that one anymore. Okay. I have started at the bottom. These are magical. It would definitely be some sort of bird, though. I took him out. <laughs> All right, what's the next one? Awaiting orders. Uh, how many bears equals a dragon? Yes, Admiral. Um, in terms of strength. It says how many bears equals a dragon. I don't know, four? Let's go to four. Right, it depends what kind of bears they are. I mean, they, are they big and strong and... Uh, how many gay people equals a dragon? Uh, is it a bad dragon? <laughs> oh no. <God>. Damn it. <laughs> oh my god. I'm not sorry for what I'm doing. I'm just sorry I had to be the one to do it. Ready. Targeting enemy vessel. <laughs> I forgot about these late questions. I took them out. Okay. Next one. Yep. <laughs> what animal would be the most amazing to see Underway. suplex? <laughs> <laughs> um, all right. What uh, what animal would be the most amazing to see suplex? Are we all in German suplex? Uh, um, I would have to say a manatee. It would just be funny to see something that fat and stupid get uh, Engaging. get hit. So you want to see me suplex? Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> I support that. I was gonna say a, um, a whale. We've lost an escort ship. A whale getting suplexed. Jesus Christ. Same direction, right? We're we're going the same way. Yeah. Oh, that's a good Nova Cannon. Ship ready. Oh, wow, that is a shit ton of missiles coming towards me. Torpedo, 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 whoa! Giraffe. Engines to maximum! Cruising speed set! Let's try to use the bulk of my ships to absorb as much as we can. Understood! Okay, so we got him coming in this way. Course plotted. Let's go ahead and get them in that, and destroy them one by one. Helm coordinates acknowledged. And then let's Engine's get behind hot. here. Orders received. Come on. We got a few hits with torpedoes. We'll wait, drag them over. Changing course. Uh, we took a hit. That should miss the bulk of our ships. Damage teams begin repairs now. This one, let's get rid of that fire. Awaiting okay. orders. Next uh next question. Underway! I just had it. Uh, what what movie sounds the most erotic when you when you change one letter in its title? Change one letter in its title? I I honestly can't think. Mope, that's all you. The Shawshank Redemption. That's a good one. But I think I can come up with better. Give me a second. All ahead, full. Course plotted. Alright, let's just pepper you as much as possible. I prefer salt person. Oh, that's gonna hit the big one. That's not too big a deal. Oh, that's not good. 
Oh, which I'm. Let's go ahead and keep pulling away. What? Press the red button? Okay. No, I can't come up with any. Yeah. Uh, the first one I came up with was changing Slumdog Millionaire to Slumdog Millionaire. Brace for impact. Engines to maximum. Boy, that one, boy. Received. Your orders. Okay. Damage teams. Keep Begin moving. Now. Shit, I don't think that All worked. Coordinates acknowledged. All ahead, full. <laughs> Setting course. Engines to maximum. Execute high energy turn. Okay, I should be able to do a shit ton of damage Understood. with just this ship. Acquiring new vector. <laughs> what the hell? What kind of maneuver is that? I know what you want. I mean, yes, you I definitely do. dodged me. So you were aiming for smart. That was your first mistake. Okay, that should take care of that one. All right, this ship's about to crash and die. Let's bring you guys back. Engines hot. And let's try to get lined up for the next ship. Okay. Hey, Orc, I'm taking you apart with one ship. Changing course. No, I think I'm doing my, most of the work. Helm coordinates acknowledged. Okay, that takes care of that ship. Brace for impact. Uh, this ship is not going to be able to make it. Execute high energy turn. Let's get that turn in. That takes care of that one. Acquiring new vector. Takes care of that one. Oh, uh, I think I just lost the big one. I did. Okay, that's fine. Engines hot. Yes, Admiral. Get back in the fight. Underway. Orders received. Okay, let's turn my ship. Get this this way. Cruising speed. Get that set. ram in. Setting course. Did a whole lot of nothing. Execute high energy turn. Let him gain some ground on us. Acquiring new vector. Okay. Damage teams begin repairs Let's get now. Get right to the butt of him. And Engines to maximum. That's your command. Course plotted. That didn't work. Cruising speed set. Understood. Ahead, full. Gotcha. Oh, so good. Good game. Well played. Well played. At least I didn't get captured this time. Are you gonna aim uh, dead to that list? <laughs> good game, Knight. It is always fun to play against you. It also oh. booted me from the game. Yeah. Alright, what oh, do we also, got for the next question? Where was it? What keeps you awake at night? Depression. Oh. <laughs> Depressing. I know, I'm so sorry. That got a. Sad. Jesus, come in soon to Sisters of Bell, the Depressor. One ship for four ships, quad kill. Boom, got him. Hey, Watch Orc, you want to fight again? Mm -hmm. uh, let's see, let's see if you can get that uh, that uh, that proper fight in there. Watch your face. Oh, let me go do me skirmish mode so I can fix me big ship. Oh, I gotta kill you, biggin. All right, I'll bring a mope with me. A mope. I'm coming with. 
Mope, I require you. The Dark Mechanicum has needs of you. <laughs> I shall try to be useful. Ah, let's make this one interesting. Let's go for Elite. Alright, next question, next question. Let's keep them coming, let's keep them coming. If there were a game made about your demon, what kind of game would it? Uh, would you want it to be? And then in parentheses, visual, yeah, visual dating sim, wink, wink. Uh, no, probably something along the lines of um. Oh, what was that? Uh, what was that one game where you're being hunted in a mental institution? Outlast. Uh, something similar to Outlast. Spooky. Actually. If you check on Steam, you can buy the Captain Jono dating simulator now. <laughs> For 300 teeth. <laughs> Next one. Yeah. No, actually, oh. I'd probably make it like, um... Oh, because I'd be working with the... Inqu well, would it be when I'm back with, um... I guess I would be able to decide... Actually, no, wait, it would be um, it would be a linear game that has a shit ton of flashbacks that you have to play through. Kind of like Silent Hill. Huh. So, like, one second you're fighting alongside the Inquisitor, like, doing whatever, and the, second, and the next second, like, her mind just starts blanking out because my character is actually kind of insane. And she's Ugh. back in the veil, like, fighting against demons of corn and everything. And as she kills other demons, she gains their powers, because that's what Valiupe does. Just to drive her even more insane. So it's like, it's a hack and slash where you're not supposed to hack and slash that much. Like, you're... The more you kill, the less reward you get. But the less you kill, and the more creative ways that you use the environment to kill everything, the more reward you get. Because it's the one thing you gotta remember about my character is she's a tormented soul. She's not, um... Unlike, a uh, Mope's demon, my character isn't blessed by Slanesh, she's cursed. Yeah, I'm heavily favored. Mm-hmm. If I had a game, it would be, like, mostly dialogue where you just picked what you chose, and it would all be about trying to, like, I would just throw situations in there where I tried to make your character evil. Engine I'd throw all sorts of like, morally greatest- It'd be like one of the Bioware games, except take out all the combat and replace it with more dialogue. And <laughs> take out all the combat and add it with more dialogue. Just more dialogue and characters. Nope, this is so, not I, I like the Star Wars ones, not because of Star Wars, but specifically because they had that morality system where you could end up light side or dark side and your character or your party members would either leave or like you based on that. Mm-hmm. I don't remember having to kill a few of them on the beach because of that. Yes. I think oh, that's just shit. a fantastic mechanic. Cruising speed set. When all of a sudden a minefield just appears in front of my ships. So you should be playing Minesweeper. Alright, uh, what's the next one? Man, it's really hard to choose between this whole block of four that are really decent. Just read all of them. Alright, what is the best- what is the best cheese to eat by itself? Just out of the package. No crackers, no nothing, just raw cheese. This is a very chaos question with him and his oh, sharp like, cheddar. No, 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 no. Best cheese! Um... I, I've kind of taken cheese out of my diet for the most part. Uh, what is it called? It's, um... Uh, the cheese that you put on pizza. What kind of pizza? Yummy to I'm gonna go with medium cheddar. Aged cheddar, actually. I'm gonna ram an orc ship head on. Uh, Rogue Didn't River. Like a great idea. Yeah, I'll be fine. Come on, boys. All ahead, full. Oh, they pulled me into an asteroid field. That ship is uh, dead. It's not good. No, that ship is done for. Oh, that ship is so done for. I don't know what to do. Understood. It's okay. Just try to survive. Why are you? Oh, they pulled me way? out of the damn thing too. You've got to get out of there. No, that ship is gone. Like this. 
There is nothing I can do to that ship anymore. But I got an idea. Trying to get this one over on the side here. Yep, my big ship is destroyed. Alright, uh, um, Mope. I'm gonna take out the biggin. Oh gosh, Alexis, maybe you should fall back to my position. Nope, I got it. I don't know what's happening! How did my ship get thrown? What is going on? My ship can't what teleport. I need to stop my ship. What am I watching? I, I don't know. My ship just got fucked, Mope. Oh gosh, Alexis, you have to get out of there. I can't! Oh gosh, you're dead. Oh gosh, there's so many orcs. Mope. It's been fun. We've lost one of our ships. Run. I'll remember you, Alexis. I'll remember you. Mope, this is the one time I will tell you to run. She died and she lived. Screaming like a stuck squeak. Ah, oh, you're a bitch. Aging warp engines. <laughs> Alright, next one. Who was the dumbest member of the Discord? Ah. Uh. Me. <laughs> uh. There were a few. You're looking at them. I, I don't know what just happened to my ship, guys. I was going to win that, and then my ship just freaked out and shot all over the asteroid field and lost half its health. And lit on fire twice. I don't know what just happened. I'm gonna chalk that up to uh, a gaming boo-boo. Are we gonna try Elite again? Oh, mozzarella. Mozzarella was the cheese. Thank you. Thank you. Alright, uh, sure. what's, what's, uh, what's the next question? What would be the most bizarre thing to murder somebody with? Um, most bizarre thing to murder somebody with? No, because that's kind of expected. Copy of the Bible. Uh, that's would, also expected. I would also really? say that's expected. Huh, never mind then. Um, probably, like, beating somebody to death by hitting them against somebody else. So you're beating somebody to death while you're beating somebody to death. I think Free does that already. <laughs> Choke him with a pancake. Alright, uh, Knight, are you done with your game? Uh, I've been done with my game. I didn't start a skirmish game, I just went to the lobby. Oh, you just healed up? Yeah. Did you want to do a second one? I'm not for always so far, no one. Alright, I'm gonna, I'm gonna give you one that you can win. Uh, do you wanna... Do you wanna invite me so it works easier? I suppose. Okay, perfect. I cannot handle clinically depressed Gosgol right now. I cannot handle clinically depressed Gosgol right now. Told him not to attack that snazzy fleet. He did it, now look at him. Alright, uh, what's the next question? Dogs thinking barks. What? What? Do, do dogs think in barks? <laughs> do dogs that think in barks? Well, do you, Nubal? Yeah, Nubal. You're the expert here. Sheesh. <laughs> Maybe. Shut up. Alright, so... Actually, I thought they'd think in smelling asses, but, you know... It's just space wolf things. <laughs> oh, look, I get the, the weird pink lady now. Uh, this is this is this is your fight. I am. Uh, I'm not good with this fleet yet. Do orcs think in Dhaka? Yes, we do. All right. What's the next question? One second. Me. <laughs> what is your guilty gift. pleasure? Huh? All right. What's the question? What is your guilty pleasure? I I can't. I, I can't say that on stream. Oh. Guilty pleasure, uh, writing smut. I also probably shouldn't say that on stream. 
Yeah. Okay. I think the only person who can say this <laughs> is me. Yeah, we can't say that on stream. Uh, next question. Who is the best Godzilla monster? Mothra. No, Mothra's yeah, a fucking... Mothra's a moth. I would say Monster X or uh, Mecha King Ghidorah. <laughs> but, 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 Ego, it's a moth. That's big. <laughs> yeah, that's fucking retarded. Oh, so it's a fleet, but we're still here, aren't we? Oh, you're just I, I, I heard that so wrong. I heard Mecha Kinky Dora. And I was so concerned. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Jesus. Okay, we got a super chat. You want to read that? Uh, yep. Yeah. Would you rather have Dorito fingers for the rest of your life and never be able to tell the difference between a muffin and a baby? <laughs> what? Uh... Never be able to tell the difference between a muffin and a baby. I can't I have to agree with you. I can't stand Dorito. They're just the Dorito fingers would be horrible. You could never touch your models again. Wait, there's yeah. a difference. To kill. For the dark gods. Wait, babies are the ones that have like their little chocolate chips in them, right? Yes. Yeah, I think so. Everybody knows this. Okay, let's see if we can, uh, we'll follow your command how well this goes. Now. Yeah, but, but definitely, definitely the muffin and the baby. Alright guys, if you have ridiculous questions of your own to ask on this stream, they can be about anything, so long as it's, you know, YouTube friendly and doesn't get me banned for life off of YouTube. Um, ask away, just use the super chat feature and goes to help, it helps donate to the channel, it helps donate to everything that I do here, and a lot of it is actually going into savings for Adepticon, and I'm super excited about that one. Oh, I'm super excited for Adepticon. All right, uh, next question. What color would a smurf, what? What color would a smurf turn if you choked it? Uh, probably really? green. Green? Yeah, like the vein, oh fuck. Vein colors. Oh. Hi, by the way, this is me Nova Cannon build, so enjoy. Ah, oh, shit. I would have guessed purple. For the dark gods. Oof, that is a good hit. Ah, oh, shit. So it looks like I do have to engage you at mid range. Mid range? Oh, no, 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 no. We ain't doing this again. Okay, let's go ahead and take down one ship at a time. Okay. We'll follow your command for now. Let's go ahead and hit their engines. Engine. 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 And engine. We'll prioritize this one above all else. Just show us okay, that's to one kill. dead. We are unstoppable. Okay. Nope, we gotta pull away. Pull away, guys. Okay, so this battle is actually really important right now. See, unlike my Space Marine, uh, my my Imperial Army list, I can't actually engage him at. Uh, long, uh, close range. I have to engage him at mid-range with this army, and if he actually gets that hit in, he's going to crush my ships. There's no offense or buts about that, and these Nova Cannons are gonna tear apart my Void Shields pretty quickly. <laughs> Why is that minefield here? The ruinous powers. Uh, no, we'll just keep going straight. Let's go. You, you're gonna go all the way over here. Your orders. Okay. Let's see if we can get through all of this. Cruising speed set. All right. Let's go ahead and course. turn this way. This one looks big and important. We'll set that to one. Ready eternally. You go this way. You can turbo boost. Just show you guys. To kill. Hide. 
Okay. Tremble, for chaos comes. It's the Slanesh fleet, so chaos does come. For the dark gods. Stop the rituals. I just got that. Ah, uh, no! Keep fighting! Command me! Keep fighting, Nova Cannon's got it! God damn, those Nova Cannons! Brought a couple, didn't I? Yeah. Hey, hey you like more combat, right? Yes. Get over here! Ready, Dumb. Ready. Oh shit, that ship is out. No! Something keep moves. moving, keep moving! No! I don't want to lose my biggin! Come here. Come here, girlie. I don't want to say whore. Hey, question. Here's a joke for you. Where does a Slaneshi ship go to get repaired? A six fold foundry. <laughs> oh, that's a good. pretty cool place. Your orders. Look at me, I'm shameless the plug. Whee! You've just rammed all of your ships into each other. <laughs> I think I might have won because of that. Yep. That was the most orky thing I've seen in a while. We have sighted an enemy ship. I don't know what to say about that. Okay, next question, next question. Let's keep these going. I'm having fun. We are Stop that. Why is Cabin Crunch the best cereal? Um, oh, I actually... I, like... I actually really like Reese's Pieces. Gotta say that. Best cereal, Reese's Pieces. I'm into cornflakes. Oh, you're oh, such a like basic bitch, Mo. Stop it! Cornflakes are so good. Ugh! Oh, wait, I thought... Wait, I thought Slanesh hated corn. Uh, oh no, that's not good. No, you're staying in this fight. Yeah, stay in the fight. I won't hit you hard. Just show us something. Hey, big ship. Hey, big ship. Hey, big ship. Mine's bigger. Cruising speed set. The engines are gone. The ship can't ship. retreat. Rocket ahead. Let's try to. Uh, my big ship is gone. It took yours with it. I'm okay with this. I honestly think I can outfly you at this point. Maybe. But can you outsmart me? Alright, let's go ahead and plan we'll this follow your command for now. Let's move up to for the, the dark gods. Let's go ahead and get past that. Cruising speed set. Okay, you're gonna have to change paths now. We are unstoppable! There we go. Ready okay. Actually, I think I can change their paths once more. Whoops. Your orders. Let's go ahead and do this, this. Trouble, for chaos comes. There we go. And then we'll prioritize this one because it's closer. Okay. Ready eternally. All right, my ships are damaged. Let's get the next question in. Let's get the next question in. Do you find pigeons annoying? Um, yes. I grew up in New York City. They're f f not New York City, but I grew up in the in the city. The fracking everywhere. Fight city chickens, aren't they? Sky rats. Sky rats. Sky skimming. They are definitely sky rats. See if I get around all of that. I do. Go ahead and just boost past all of them. If it messes up your backside, don't you like, like it? None hit. Just God, Orc, you make me kill. so unsatisfied. God, this is really hard with this new map, new mouse. Come on, me. Oh, I'll leave you unsatisfied. Okay, hold on. Boys, give me rock out. I'm about to go be a personal visit. <laughs> I already destroyed you, biggin. Mm -hmm. You only got, uh, what, two ships left? Tear them apart. I'm just gonna focus you now. Your orders. Who's got the Slaneshi mark up? Yes, but see, see the ship you're aiming at right now, Gorge Kosha, it's got a s angry squig on board. And now it's dead. 
You know what? I think it's time we do as orcs do, because if you don't kill us, we don't lose, so we don't lose. Goodbye, orc. Just kidding. Staying for the fight. Just need to get me bombs on. Just need to get me bombs off cooldown. Engines hot. Okay. I can I can roll with this. Uh oh. Oh wait. You can't. Bye, Ork. Yeah. Good boy. <laughs> well. Don't worry, Ork. One day. One day. You may be as glorious as your queen. Hey, don't worry. I got you in the sequel. <laughs> Alright, next question, next question, next question. What is your favorite thing that has happened on the Discord? My favorite thing that has ever happened on my Discord. Keep in mind, my Discord has been up for almost a year, if not a year. I'm not sure. It's been over a year. But my favorite thing to have happened on my Discord was probably one user who had the his RP character die and he got really butter about it. I know who you're talking about. It was it was just really funny. And then he had an argument with me. <sighs> I'm sorry, that's just greatly amusing to me. Aww. Favorite moment on the Discord was when I was allowed to, uh... Hey, actually, here, I love him, say it's yeah. Oh, thank you, Orc. It was a time when Voltavarius Tarvok got to step onto the field of battle for the first time. Oh, hey, when you make a Mechanicum fleet in the next uh, next game, I can't wait to crush it. Oh, Ren Roseless. I <laughs> forgot you were here. Anyway. Any. Um, John, uh, thank you for showing up. Uh, me and Mope are going to take over from here. Are we going for Elite again? Uh, well, I can't do Elite with my Chaos Fleet. Good I'll luck, you two. Yeah. Have a good stream. Thank you, John. All right, what's the next question? Da -da -da, I just had it. If you were to have if you were to have a weapon from 40k in the real world, what would you want? Ooh, 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 I got this. Hang on. Hang on. Uh one second, BRB. Okay. Ten bucks says she's getting her bolter. <laughs> nope, she's getting her inferno pistol. Uh Alexis, is it your Inferno pistol? Okay, I got it. Is my it your bolter. Inferno pistol? No, my bolter. Uh, I was right. You were right. I love my I thought bolter. it would be your Inferno pistol. No, oh, look at my glorious. Ah. Oh. oh yeah, I gotta pick a fleet. My Inferno's pistol is amazing, but, 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 Bolter. Because it's got a combi melt on it. It's a Godwin pattern Diaz Bolter with Kraken rounds and combi melta. Why? Because, why not? <laughs> I don't have a ship with 32 points, that's lame. <laughs> Nubal one, Mope zero. Nubal wins. Oh. Yay. Next question, next question, next question, next question. Oh, wait, no, Mope. What, what, is it? what would you want? Hmm. Let's see. If I can pick any weapon in 40k. Let's go ahead. And go with a Blastmaster. That would be cool, because those are almost all demon weapons. You would also drag a demon into reality. I mean... 
I could just play whatever I wanted and it would work. And if people didn't like it and thought my music was bad, well, they'd die. Yeah. I'm gonna take a left side, you take right side. Okay. Look at my bolter though, it's so pretty and so much fun and s kills heretics dead. Just pew 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 pew. I really gotta heretics finish this part. like me. Uh bolt I would need something a lot bigger than a bolter to kill you. Alright, you ready for this? I'm always ready. Alright, let's go and kill some transport ships. Put their prior Make sure you prioritize them at one. It'll make it much easier to for bombers and lances to actually hit them when you're not paying attention. Advice taken, Admiral. We have sighted an enemy ship. Also, move your ship so that they're directly lining up with the... Um, with the transport ships, so even if you're, again, not paying attention, you'll just ram them, and they'll die. Sounds good to me. Just show us something to kill. We'll follow your command. Uh, next question? Yep. What is the cutest dog breed? Dog mutt breed. Mutt breed? Yeah. I'm not sure. Ah! It got away! No! Just show us something. Um, probably a Labradoodle or a Pikachu. Pikachu. For the dark gods. Pikachu's Chihuahua. Pikachu. Engines hot. Oh, I lost the ship. We've lost one of our line ships! For the ruinous powers! What was Gabe the dog mixed with? He was a Pomeranian or something. That's what I would go with. <laughs> you and your Pomeranians. I love Pomeranians. Or, uh, Bull English Mastiffs. Locking weapons! Oh wow, this ship is gonna block me. That's really funny. Cruising speed set. Ah, I'm not gonna get to it. Nope, I think we lost. Because I can't no, stop fine. these two. It's okay, I've got two that I'm gonna kill. We'll follow your command for now. Yeah, but I gotta kill two also. No, it shows that we already have two. We just have to kill two more. Setting and I'm gonna kill course. two more. So it's okay. Cruising speed set. Come on. Enemy transport annihilated. Come on, just just give it a little tap. Just tapity tap tap. Moving to those coordinates. Got it. Yay! I got it at the last second. And by last second, I mean Get I it. killed one. I think you actually won this mission on your own. Sometimes transport missions are easy. Sometimes they're hard. But they're always better than planetary assault. Those are ridiculously hard. I really can't see Wow, that was super sour. Holy shit. Ah. Alright, what's the next one? Uh, I just... One second. It, it involved cardboard. Okay. If you were given an infinite supply of cardboard... What would you make with it? Um, I don't know. I'd probably stack a lot of it up and try to make like, I don't know. Like, what can you do with it? I, I know you could use um, cardboard ground up into shavings and then mix it with a ton of glue and make uh, that, that type, the new type of brick for homes. And I'd probably do something along the lines of that. Like, try to mix it with a ton of industrial glues and everything to try to make homes for the homeless. Uh, if not that, I'd probably, I don't know, donate a lot of it to, like, 
uh, or almost all of it to like everybody that needed it so that way uh big businesses wouldn't have to have like tree farms and shit like that i make a bunch of fortresses for the tabletop with that That works too. Who doesn't want to play on a cool fortress? You could like recreate the interior of a ship to play in. Yeah, that's true. I'd try to save the planet and Mope would do something selfish. I'll save the planet with botany. Fair enough. Next one. This one can either be cute or bad. What is the first thing you will do with Vigi when he gets to America? <laughs> I'm taking his ass clothes shopping. Because he ain't got no style. Also, I'm going to need some new bras, just saying. And I'm pretty sure he'd want to tag along for that. <laughs> I'm going to get some new matching sets. Also, I apparently got to go uh, mope. Uh, I got to go mope shopping. I'm uh, expensive. Uh, yeah, just right. Just letting you know. Yeah, right, mope. Oh. Oh. Uh. So, uh, want to read this one? Oh yeah, super chat uh, one. Yeah, what do you cling to the corpse emperor? Slanesh can offer you so much more. This is the, this is probably why Slanesh gave Mope the better butt. Fight me, nerd. Oh my god, Alexandria, you're gonna die. <laughs> I, um. um... Uh, drug her in now or wait a bit? <laughs> nah, she's fine, she's fine. And why I cling to the Imperium? Because I still have faith in humanity. We can never become gods while we are still limited by our mortality. We have to become something, something greater than human, Alexis. We have to become gods ourselves. Something the Emperor will deny from you, for himself. Gods are monsters with different names. The... I would say that definitely applies to the God Emperor. Mm -hmm. But he is the per um, he is the personification of perfect perfection for humanity. I disagree. The personification for perfection is only Slanesh. He's a liar, a deceiver. He's tricked you into wasting your life into false devotion when he's never going to care or notice you. Those are the lies that Slanesh has whispered into your ears, Mope. You know it's true. You know the Emperor will never recognize you. The Emperor recognizes you know the, Emperor the individuals just sees you. that he sees, he, sees you. he sees you as just a tool, Alexis. You're nothing to him. And I am fine with that. The whole entire religion is just a trick to make you devoted to a we god that doesn't care about you. A liar who's going to keep divinity for himself and deny it to you when you could have it too. Tremble. I counter times. that with living saints. We've sighted an enemy ship. Do you think you're going to end up a living saint, Alexis? I can see it. You don't want to be a living saint, Alexis? What would that entail? An eternity of being reborn just to die? We have sighted an enemy ship! For a god who still doesn't care about you and still just views you as a tool. Minor details. For the dark gods. So long as you know the true nature of things. That's a cruiser. Oh god, wait, is that a... What, what chapter is that? Oh no. Mope, we're gonna lose. No, 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 it's just furries. Wait, is it furries? Oh, okay. Yeah, you're gonna lose. Oh, then we're fine. We've sighted an enemy ship. Tactical. Sorry about that. No, you're I was fine. Say, 
the real truth is, Alexis, the Emperor doesn't love you. That's the Emperor doesn't- like. I don't need the Emperor's love. My devotion is for him and him alone. You'll get no rewards for it. And that is Just, fine. Why are you willing to sacrifice everything for a, go for a being who doesn't care about you? Don't I'm not you doing it for that him. You, this entire mentality is a trick? He's tricked you. That is fine. My faith in humanity keeps me strong. I have faith in humanity too, Alexis. And that is why I think we all need to ascend to demonhood. We could be so much more. Just like the Emperor, except he denies it to you. Selfishly keeping divinity for himself. Filling you with false dogmas where you feel bad for wanting more. You keep telling yourself these sweet lies. The truth is that entire religion was built to make you have the mentality of a willing slave. And look how well it's worked. Listen to you reason with it now. You're happy to serve him with no reward. For what? And that's fine. I've taken out one of their ships, so he just needs to take out one more. Okay. One more big ship. For the ruinous powers. I fear not the whispers of the chaos gods. We are I'm not asking they... you to fear. I'm just asking you to open your eyes because you deserve more than eternal servitude to a god that will never notice or care about you. You could have so much more. And I'm okay with that. Executing Are you really? Mm-hmm. Is there another part of you that wants more? Moving You're happy to sacrifice orders. yourself for a stranger who views you as a tool, who will give you nothing? Mope, I've spent thousands of years in the warp and Before it has yet to break my will. You look at it wrong, I'm not trying to break your will, I'm trying to help you. <laughs> Rewards are for chumps. <laughs> that was fun, Mope. That was fun. <laughs> Alright, what's the next one? So, don't, what is your opinion on clock towers? They're pretty. That they're they're neat. They're all right. I don't feel one way or the other about them. My ships are beaten up. Next question? Yep. I swear I just said it. What is your favorite alternate history setting? Alternate history setting. Um. Uh. I guess Starship Troopers history? I don't I'll know, go just... with Star Trek. Star Trek is such a nerd. Star Trek is the God. greatest example of why humanity is amazing. You're so... Oh, what is this? <laughs> I'm just saying, if the Imperium was like Starfleet, <laughs> I would have never turned to chaos. Oh my God. Oh, that's, I'm that's just a good saying. question. That's a good question. Do you miss the warp? In character? I would answer yes and no. There are aspects of it that I miss. Ah, screw it, I'm gonna take the big one. Next question. What did you, I want you to go into more detail about that one. What do you miss about the warp a lot? And you wanna know, you wanna know what I miss about the warp? I do. 
the music, the artistry. Billions of cultures put out and laid out in front of me. Did you like the feeling of love and care that you got, that you never got from the Emperor? Mope, I did get love and care. A lot of it. From a very special person that abandoned me. Love and care is not something that my demon lusts for. No, oh, I'm not even a demon. But you could be. Demons are weak. What makes you say that? Right? I've killed tons of them in my day. But you can kill a demon over and over again. For some reason, that doesn't seem to stop them. Oh, I can dismantle them. Devour their essence and use them up like batteries. Or is it the or is it this or is it the demon in your sword that's devouring them? Valiope has many abilities, that being one of them. But me myself, I can dismantle a demon. We're unstoppable! Weaker class ones, not bigger ones. Yet. I wonder what dying but feels like. Dying for real. There is one human that did it. In fact, she killed three keepers of secrets. He used them up. Spit them out. Engine's Although hot. she succumbed to her own ambitions. In the Not end, done. even she was weak. You call it weakness, but I think that's just a stigma to stop you from seeing the truth and the reality that Slanesh is a real god who actually cares, whereas the Emperor is just using you all. He doesn't care about humanity. He only cares about himself. He's a megalomaniac that's convinced you all to let him use you. I am fine with that, so long as it benefits humanity in the long run. But it doesn't. It only benefits him. And he is the personification of humanity. A lie. It's not true. I am okay with that lie, then. He doesn't care about humanity at all, and he's no more a human than a demon is. We have sighted an enemy ship! You argue divinity. My we argument is... An enemy ship. A lifetime of servitude is better than a, a lifetime for a target. Oh shit. Can you actually make it to that? Possibly. Okay, I'm gonna try to make it there too. Your orders. Favor me, Slanesh. I know you do. This stupid ship is in my way! Oh, uh, we got orcs. Inbound. This ship is not gonna make it, so I'm gonna leave you behind. I'm actually there, just about. Command me! But Alexis, you never said- oh wait, yeah, you did, never mind. Okay, next question. Oh, uh, Lord, gee, that's good. If you if you had a cake diorama about your life, what would it look like? If I had a cake diorama of my life, what would it look like? I have no idea how to answer that. I got nothing for that one. So yeah. What is the best way to eat an egg? Scrambled. Actually, I make my eggs weird. I said this on my Discord a couple of days ago. So when I start mixing my eggs, this is the motion for mixing and not anything else. Don't you get any wrong ideas. But when mixing an egg in a bowl, this is what you're carrying. Like it's a bowl right there and you mix it. You put a little bit of milk in there and then you whip that up and you put a little bit of cheese in there. And then when you do all of that, you get yummy, delicious, tasty eggs. I'm trying to get that orc off of you. Okay, I'm gonna let that ship run. I don't think that's gonna save it though, I think it's doomed. No, it is doomed. 
All right. It might get out of here. Okay. What about you, Mope? Favorite way to eat an egg? Alexis, I'm so sorry. Are you ready for the last disappointment tonight? Oh my god. Oh my god. I don't like eggs. Of course you don't like eggs. You don't like anything, Mope. It's true. I don't actually eat. Come on, man. I just sustain, or I sustain myself on the suffering of others. Hmm. I can see that. Moving to those coordinates. Okay. Next question. What would be the greatest bamboozle Trendy. that would amuse you quite immensely? The greatest bamboozle that amused me quite greatly. Uh, Dawn of War 3. Setting course. That amused me greatly, because I called it. I knew that game was going to be garbage. Engine's hot. My ship or else. I'm going to say the Destiny games. The, the what? Destiny 1 and Destiny 2. No oh shit, that was a planetary target? I wasn't paying attention. I never pay attention to the mini map. Shit. I tried to get to I'll it in time. Alright, uh, next question. What is your worst date story? Uh So, uh, I, I once kind of walked out on a date, um, so this guy, this guy, he invited me out for dinner, alright, um, he said that he didn't smoke, he didn't do anything, and he was a nerdy guy, and he was awesome, okay? I was really happy. I was like, alright, maybe maybe he's a good guy. And no, this is not my last boyfriend. This is a, a couple of years ago, okay? Alright. Um, so, I learned a little bit about him before we go out. He learned a little bit about me. He knows about me, so it's not like, oh, uh, Because I, I always tell people about myself prior to going out on dates with them. Because I'm a nice person. Um, so... He says he's going to come and pick me up and we're going to go out to this uh, this restaurant. And I'm like, okay, that sounds good. You know, that's that's a good date, right? Go out to a restaurant, have dinner, whatever. Right. Um, instead, his buddy comes and picks me up. Forward to the um, I was really okay. confused by that. Cruising speed safe. I would be too. Um, then they drove me to his house to pick him up because he wasn't ready yet. Alright, you're following so far? Yes. And then the entire house stunk horribly like things that I can't mention on YouTube. Be things that Nurgle would just be like holy crap. Stop. Nurgle, not Slanash. Yeah, Nurgle. It would be like, that's disgusting, Ew. bro. Ew. Um, it was, his house was so bad. He was like a, one of those hoarders. Those I, I was not expecting Ew. that. Um, it was so bad that I actually, uh, I messaged my friend on my phone and I had to wait outside in the cold weather to get a signal so that my friend could call me to tell me that something died and she em emergency needs me, like, right now. She needs to come and get me because sh she needs to console me. You know, like, uh, I need to console her. Dang. It was that bad. I had to run from this guy because it was disgusting. For the ruinous powers! That's pretty bad. Yeah, that was my worst date. That's pretty atrocious. Moving to those coordinates. Oh, thanks. 
What about you, There's I went out with a guy and ended up puking in the middle of a bar. That's like, pretty bad. Wait, did you activate like, this? Or I did puked I? right at the table, like in my own. Like I was just like, oh my gosh, I just puked on myself. I, I don't even know how to describe it. <laughs> it sucks. It was so horribly embarrassing. I don't even know how to put it into words. Uh, Mope, is that you doing tactical cogitators? Return to normal Sorry about that. Yeah, you're fine. I'm fighting off two targets. Ah, uh, shit, that... I think that's the last bombardment. I think we lost. I'm dead. Oh, you're gone. I've been dancing around these guys for a while. It's okay. Shit. Alright, next... Uh, we had a super chat. We had a super chat. We had a super chat. Yeah. Uh, what is your biggest fright? Setting course. I am... Oh, what am I actually, like, really scared of? I know no fear, by the way. I want to go skydiving. I want to go, uh... Follow your command. I want to do a whole bunch of crazy shit. I go on roller coasters, like, all the time. They're really fun. Um, oh shit, there is one. I might be able to get to this one. If my engines are still good. Um, but my biggest frightening is when a bug lands on me. Like, it just flies and lands on me. I freak out. I am such a bitch when it comes to bugs landing on me and just giving- and just scaring me. Okay. I, I might be able to win this mission, Mope. Good luck. And then I'm gonna say that my biggest fear Please is definitely me. getting arrested. Oh my god, are you kidding me? They're gonna hit me with stasis. Wow, that sucks. I can't do shit about it either. And I'm stuck in it. Oh, that sucks. We're gonna lose because of that. Oh, no. Come on. Shields are holding, Captain. For now. Go, 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 go. I still might be able to win this. Oh my god, we might win. No, the come on! Wins. Go! Go, my ship! I know Ranger you're slow, Ranger. but go! Come on! It's right there! I'm gonna lose! We lost it! Look how close I am! It's oh well. Ugh. Bitch, I hate you. I All hate right. those missions. So do I. Um, there was a person who donated to play Woman of Dragon Man here now. Hmm? Oh, yeah, sure. Alright, Dragon Man. Who is well, it? I guess you're gonna play against them now. Yeah. Well, I'm gonna go use the restroom then. Oh, can you uh, unmute them? Um, it, there we go. Okay. Up, nerds? Yo! Do you want to play with or against? Fight me, nerd. Ooh. Okay. All right. I Fight like me, this. nerd. I like this. Good luck! Um, do I have you on Steam? That is the can you hear question. Me now? Yes, I can. What's up, nerd? Um, do I have you on sh Steam? It's Alex. You know me. I'm on the server. I'm on the patrons. Yeah, I know, but do I have you on Steam? Yeah, I don't actually. No, what you is don't. your Steam name? Alright, uh, shoot me a request really quickly. I will alt tab out of this really fast. Bring this back up so that I can get it. Okay, I just had to stream up on that for a second. I was freaking out a little bit. <laughs> That's fine. <laughs> the delay is weird. Yeah, the delay is always weird. Okay. 
Ah, this is taking up way too much of my processing and shit. Okay. Uh, I just need you to shoot me a friend request really quickly. And once I get that, we can get the game in. I still can't believe I lost that last mission. That was, ugh. Did you send it yet? What's your steam? Eco Queen Alexis. Same as it is on everything else. And while we wait for this, let's get another question in. What? Uh, why is an alarm clock going off when it actually turns on? These are some questions straight out of Ed, Ed and Eddie, I swear. <laughs> yeah, that show Why? is about as old as these memes. I love those shows. Okay. Everything's just being nice and slow. You sent the invite, correct? There we go. Two new invites. Once this loads, let's go ahead and... I'm just slaughtering some space marines right now. I'll only take me... Oh, and they're dead. Never mind. Okay. Oh, there were space forays. Huh. What fleet Nothing are you going to focus well. on in Battlefleet 2? Uh, it's oh, going to be Imperial Navy. I love my Imperial Navy so much. Uh, I think you're mispronouncing cannon fodder. Yeah. Or if you're fighting the Nids, dinner. Hmm. I do like the Nids. Okay, so now I have you on here. There we go. Let's in Oh wait, this is uh invite you to play. Um invite me to your game so that I can join you. So I could just verse you, because I have it open in skirmish. Does Mike Wazowski wink or blink? <laughs> Alright, let's get the next question in. Alrighty. Um, if you were to be put into a video game, what game would you wanna would you wanna live the rest of your life in as an NPC? Live as an NPC. Oh, that is such a tough one. I don't know, something where I, I would be, like, happy and peaceful and everything for the rest of my life. Um, probably, like, one of the people living in a castle in Skyrim or something like that, or... Personally, I would pick one where I'm in a corner of the game where I'm very unlikely to ever run into a player. Because I feel like that would be your living nightmare, living in a game. It's like, oh god, it's the, it's the PC. <laughs> Oh no. All right, did you oh, invite auto me? To... Oh no. There we go. Click to join. And it should take me a second. Ah, the heartless ecstasy is lost in the warp. Ah, that's sad. Ah well. Um the murder. There we go. Match found. Waiting for the server to connect. Please wait. All right, next question. Oh, whoops, I haven't set up in the skirmish. Ah, well, same difference. Okay. Fighting with you, fighting against you, so much, it's all the same. All right, you're, I'm bringing the pride of purity and the pride of ascension. Oh, I'm bringing the dementia of persecution and the litany of heresy. Mm. I think Fun name. I think I'm gonna switch out that one. For let's make that my line ship. All my demonettes are wearing their favorite hot pants, and they are so ready to go. A bunch of them even have sp have uh, Emperor's Children's dates. They can't wait to go on the ball on that <laughs> old ship. It's gonna be a blast. All right, so I'm bringing the spear of Provoska and the pride of purity. 
I don't know. In my experience with the nerds, a lot of them have quite a bit of purity, but I don't see a lot of pride. Hmm. True enough. Alright, let's get that other question in. Alrighty. Oh, uh, what is the best way to eat fries? Eat fries? Yup. Um... Best way to eat them with your mouth. <laughs> I mean... I don't know what the what the actual question is. I think Maybe. the I, I think the question might imply like do you have them with something like with cheese, make it poutine with ketchup. Oh, eat them by no, hand, it, eat them with a fork, that kind of thing. Here's what you do: you cover them in cheese, you cover them in bacon bits, you put a little tiny bit of ranch on top of that. Best fries ever. Chili cheese fries, Alexis. Your yeah, you should see it. You should see it up here in Canada. There's literally you can get Order fries that are more cheese and grease than fries. All right, I'm gonna head to the right. Are you gonna stick with me or go in a different sure. direction? I'm a good. I'm gonna stick to the yes, right. Admiral. I just like doing circles around them while I lance battery them, and the demonettes occasionally pop over to say hi and give hugs. Okay, so you're running lance boats then. Awaiting yeah. orders. And you know me and my rammy ships. Oh yes, Solnesh appreciates your phallic uh, aggression. Yes, Admiral. Okay, next question, what do we got? What is the best Disney movie? I don't Disney like Wars. Disney movies. What? <laughs> I'm just triggering Mope, I'm kidding. No, I don't like Disney movies. Dang. I personally find Mulan to be a pretty cool movie. Mulan was good. There are lots of good Disney movies. I would say the like, best is the Lion King. Orders? Was the question what's the best one or what's your favorite one? Best um, one. I swear I. It, uh, what is the best? One? Mm. Lion King one. Lion King one might be it. That movie was pretty fantastic and amazing. Mm -hmm. The other thing I think that would come close could maybe be Monsters Inc. or Toy Story. Shit. I'm not gonna give it to any Pixar's. I really. Like, where they can just, like, make the 3D model and then have the computer auto-animate it for them. Yeah, all I'm saying is How to Train Your Dragon might be better than all of Disney's movies. No way. That was, How that, to Train Your Dragon. Yeah. Go ahead, Alexander. Yeah. That, that was a really good movie. I really liked that one. I liked it a lot. It was fantastic, but it wasn't on Disney level. Yeah, it was better. Oh, you crazy. Disney movies are fantastic. I really like Little Mermaid too, honestly. I think that one might be up there with Lion King. Well, in all fairness, Disney movies also means Disney Wars. So are they really that good? <sighs> I don't want to get into that right now. Not on this. So, wreck. <laughs> Awaiting orders. Um, do I want to engage and fully commit? Hot. Yeah, I guess I will. Oh, Zinch, why are you here? Go away. I'm here to fight the orcs, not you. Retros. Cruising speed set. Okay, these two ships are pretty much done for. One ship's already dead. Course plotted. Um, let's go ahead and get you over here. Setting course. Let's get that nice turn in so I don't have to burn my retros. Coordinates acknowledged. Alright, I'm gonna have to burn retros just a little bit. And the ship is dead. Oh, it dodged! No, oh, you don't get to run. Tappity tap. And you're gone. How many more ships do we have? Four, and they're orc ships? Okay. Okay, let's get this ship straight ahead. Initiate emergency repairs. Okay, let's stop. Let's Order ram again. Acquiring new vector. Okay, let's go ahead and get this turn in. Underway. And then let's get that ram in. Burn retros. Let's get that turn in. Let's get Engines that ram in. Maximum. Like, am I the only one who thinks the orcs are kind of underpowered in this game? Oh, they're really powerful in the story mode. Cruising speed yeah, in the story mode they're great, but in this, it's like, if they miss the big red button, it, they're kind of pathetic. 
Yeah. I wouldn't say they're pathetic. I really like the orcs in this game. Oh yeah, they're fun. I just mean power-wise, they seem kind of weak. And like I'm fighting them in close range with chaos ships, and I'm winning because I can keep dodging their rams. And the AI doesn't ram aside from the big red button, so. Huh. Oh, that lag got me. We got a little bit of lag. We got a. I hate lag. Damn it! How is this orc out maneuvering me? Is my ship damaged? Oh well, it's keeping him off of you, so. I mean, that works. Damage teams begin repairs now! Ugh, my poor ship. Engines hot! Okay. At your command. And that takes care of that ship, and I think that's the last ship. Good game. Setting course. Good game. Now, do you want to get a game against me? So, yeah, sounds good. Okay. I continuously forget it's push to talk in this, and so that's why I'm being dumb. <laughs> well, Nubo keeps forgetting to ask questions. Hmm? No, I don't. Yeah, huh? Hey, don't be mean to the puppers. I love my puppers. puppers. What is your best kind of dance? Um, I'm starting to, well, I'm starting to push to learn swing dance, so swing dancing. Swing dancing? Yeah. What's that? What? How do you not know this? Look up American swing dancing. It's, it's glorious and amazing. I'm from Europe. I don't know these things. <laughs> it was made in Europe. Perfected. It's a fair America. lot of things were made in Europe. Europe is a big place. This question? Mm hmm. Oh, wait, Mo, what was your favorite dancing? Mm, I don't really know how to dance, to be honest with you. Mope are teaching you how to dance. That would be fantastic. Okay. All I can imagine now is you guys making a music video. <laughs> I would do but that. Yeah, when I was a kid, uh, it's so weird. My dad would not let me learn how to dance. <laughs> All right. He, um, you, he knew Solnesh would eventually have you, and he didn't want to give you a head start. <laughs> uh, Alexandria, invite me to a game where we're reversing each other. Okay, I just got to go into the multiplayer to do that. All right. Mm, yes. Yeah, I thought so. All right. Next question. Do, do, do. If you were if you were to combine a meat and a weapon, what would be the result? Um, meat. probably sausage cannon. Just, just a cannon that fire sausages at people. I'm gonna do a bacon shotgun. <laughs> now, would it come uh, out the perfect balance admiral, of meat? Or, does your admiral for multiplayer uh, can like get uh, also use like the um, fleet from um, skirmish? Yeah, that's what it is. Thing? Is it in Skirmish then? Nope, you go to. You can pick Admiral game and stuff. Huh. So, like, Alexis can host a game and invite you. And then when you go in, you'll select Chaos and you'll select your Chaos Admiral from Skirmish. Uh, okay, can you just invite me then? Because I'm having some issues over here. It's being weird. What? Why does it say New Admiral? Yeah, that's that. what I'm getting. Um, nuclear, uh, next you question. have to go to custom game, not multiplayer. Um, oh, that makes sense. I you do can't custom. actually get out of this. Sure. Uh, bottom left corner. Or you just hit escape and then go over to my menu. Oh, I hit caps at some point. Cap and butts, sure. Oh, there we go. I wonder if I can escape out using that. Yes, yes, I can. All right, um, next question. If corn oil is made from corn and vegetable oil is made from vegetables, 
What is baby oil made from? Baby oil. Uh, seals. Haven't you ever been clubbing? Oh. <laughs> but I can make some bad jokes. Oh, lances. I think you might actually beat me. Uh, uh, is your fleet supposed to pop up on the left side so you can, like, pick your ships on this screen, or...? In a minute, it does. Oh, uh, okay, fair enough. Alright, next question. Why isn't 11 pronounced 181? <laughs> 181? <laughs> uh, because a mathematician at some point in history choked on their tongue and died. That's terrible. That's that's a hilarious question. I don't have an answer. I'm Your okay face doesn't have an answer. Alright, next question. If Jimmy cracks corn and no one cares, why is there a song about it? Because he wanted to be relevant. I mean, just look at all the feminist channels. Oh my god. I'm so sorry, that was bad. I'm sorry. Forget that I said that. Hey Alexa, stop being Canadian. That's my job. Um... Why is this taking forever? Eh. Uh. Next question. Yep. If you made it a bulldog and a shih tzu, would it be called a bullshit? <laughs> you better believe it. <laughs> That's great. Um... I think it something went wrong because this has never taken this long yeah. before. Try to remake it. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Ducks or geese? Ducks, geese are evil. Oh, you're gonna invite again? Okay. Let's see if we can get this. Wait, ducks or geese? Yeah. Uh, tsh, ducks. Geese are just vile, evil creatures. They're abominations of Zinch. They're prettier, though. Abominations of Zinch. But they're prettier. Zinch. But All pretty. Right. But Zinch. Generated pretty. profile. You don't even have a captain name. What is wrong with you? Um, do I, should I get the list, or? Ha, huh, I get it. Uh, next question. When the door, uh, one second, I messed that shit, I messed that one up. Who closes the door when the bus driver gets off? The goblin in the engine. Holy crap. That's a, <laughs> that's a mind breaker right there. Trust me, just ask the mega captain. He'll tell you. Why does this not work with you? I don't know, you host. Okay, I'll host. We'll get this. We'll get this working. Trust me, I must have broken like 37 mirrors when I, like, just after I was born. Nothing worked for me. Ever. Okay, next question. I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I have an answer to this one before I ask it. It's called Bad. All right, and what what is a good nickname for people from Arizona? No idea. I want to say Aryan, but I think that might be a bit too much. Sonians. All right, I sent an invite. Okay, I got it. Hmm. What would I say? Arizonian is so weird. Zoners? That's like California. Huh. <laughs> Let's not make that joke on stream. I want to stay monetized. I just mm. mentioned California. It's not like I actually mentioned why. That's funny. Mm. Fair enough, fair enough. You know what I wonder? I guess if you were from Southern Arizona, you could call them Sonoran. And if they were from Northern Arizona, you could call them, oh wow, Coconinoan. That, 
<laughs> Such a horrible region name, yeah. no one can say oh, that. God. That's terrible. the tribal name of the uh, Oompa Loompas from uh, Chattering <laughs> Tackle Backer. No, I'll have you know that we people from Coconino are very... <laughs> Alright. <laughs> uh, next question. One second. Why is grape nut cereal called that when it contains neither grapes nor nuts? I don't even know what cereal that is. Grape nut. God damn it. That's what it's called. I know, but I don't know, like, the cereal itself. Oh. Who is the best Chaos God? Why is it Nurgle? It's not Nurgle. Nurgle's disgusting. The best, pa the best Chaos God is the perfect one. That is Sol Nash. Agreed. Uh, yes, Admiral. Your orders? If corn is perfect, then Nurgle is, uh, Nurgle is pretty. <laughs> I mean, in a, in a certain light, Nurgle could be very pretty. He creates life. Life can be beautiful. That is true. Through a, through, nope. through a serious concussion doesn't count. You're gonna say maggots are beautiful, bacteria, festering rot. He also creates flowers. Course plotted. That each no, face. flowers are slaneshi because flowers are a reproductive organ. This is a valid point. And also, fuck you and your torpedoes. Hey, 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 knowledge. language. Oh, sorry. At your command. What is the meaning of life in three verbs? Ship ready. Um. Good luck, Mope. What is the verb form of hedonism? So you got two going over this one. Debauch? No, not the. Um, I don't think the you're. The verb form of hedonism. Hold on a second. Okay. How the many torpedoes do you have? Enemy ship sighted. Like. Okay, so I did find your bigger ships. Let's prioritize these above all others. What's the verb for pursuit of pleasure? Hedonistically? Enemy ship Hedonistically. Hedonistically. It's the closest thing, it's an it's adverb, so... Yeah, I guess that's close enough. Your orders? Hmm. I always did find it interesting that in this game, the stasis bombs also affect the torpedoes. Mm-hmm. They do in the tabletop Taking as well. Heavy damage. Torpedoes must be either way worse or way better in the tabletop. Lightning strike successful. Okay. Awaiting orders. Is it just me? Do you always have to get very, very close to the enemy before you actually Underway. see them pop up on like your sensors? Enemy ship sighted. Good question. Yep. Changing course. Eggs. How is eggs a question? Cruising speed set. It's eggs with a question mark, therefore it counts as a question. I guess yes. eggs. I respond with tomatoes. Look on target. He keeps giving me more questions, it won't stop. Okay, let's go ahead and get in. Ship half yes, dead. Okay, looks <laughs> like you only have five ships. Enemy ship crippled by the lightning strike. Next question. Mm -hmm. what, what, what would be the perfect outfit in which case you you could describe someone as gosh diddly darn spiffy as heck? At your command. I. what? Kingpin in a tuxedo with a boulder, looking very angry. Are you running from battle? You coward. I'm not running from battle, they have another party to get to. That's cowardice! What is cowardice, really? That's what you're doing right now. Let me shoot some torpedoes up your ass. Hey, I did not consent to this. The Imperial Navy. You missed. Come on now. I didn't miss. I find that with my captains are insubordinating, despite the fact the Slaneshi thing does that to your ships. Or, I don't know. 
All ahead, full. Next question. Mm -hmm. What community has the best fan art? Yeah, uh, I actually time. really like 40k's fan art. That's your command. Hey, I thought we were not supposed to use those. Hmm? Why not? It's part of the game. Changing course. Probably because you've complained every time someone else has put them on. Huh? Yes. No, I only complain when... Uh, well, actually, I only complained when Mope left it on. Yeah. I suppose. Okay, let's go ahead and destroy that final... Sh that ship right there. Ship ready. And then let's get rid of this last one. Understood. Yes, Admiral. Oh, that ship's leaving too. Underway. Yeah, I don't care what's up here. Like, if all of my ships have had their captains run off Engines before they're even the half maximum. health. Except yeah, my one. ships are big and scary. Cruising speed set. We are the Imperial mm. Navy. I don't even think I need these other three ships. Your orders? Probably not. I think my biggest ship is a battle cruiser that I just Lock got like two night missions ago. Okay. All ahead, Let's go ahead and move in and destroy that ship. Awaiting orders. Okay. And yeah, that ship is gone no matter what. Brace for impact. <laughs> okay. Course plotted. Yeah, like every single one of my ship, the captain ran off like immediately at okay. the worst possible moment. Captains have the best morale. Pardon? Chaos does not have the best morale. No, yeah, they don't. No, they really don't. And like every time I was trying to maneuver, they'd stop because the captain was trying to run away. And then they were much slower because of the mutiny debuff. Oh well, good game. Good one. I don't know. It always seems to me like just like the uh, imperial ships are just a lot sturdier than everybody else's. It's because of the way I build my orcs. ships. Yeah, fair enough, I guess. Like, I, I like build my ships the way that you're not supposed fleet. to. Anyway, Alexandria, thank you for joining us. That was a lot of fun. Yeah. See you, nerds. Take care. Don't forget, See you later. Zink is a nerd. Best 40k waifu? Best 40k waifu. Hmm. I. God, I, I'm torn. I'm gonna go with. Um. <sighs> Alright, Mope, you first. Best 40k waifu. Slanesh. That's a really good one. I was thinking either Slanesh. Mariel Sabathio, uh, Celestine. Um, I gotta, I gotta go with Celest. Oh no, because then there's Ethereal Cern, and she's awesome too. Slanesh is the prettiest. That was my decision, or that was why I made my decision. I'm gonna go with Slan. I'm gonna go with not Slanesh. I'm gonna go with Celestine, best waifu. <sighs> I don't like this Imperial angle you're going for, Alexis. I know, I'm just spiting you at this point. Goodness. All right, let's get some, uh, how many more questions are there? Uh, yeah, like maybe 200. we should just call it after another game or two. Uh, let's get some questions from the chat then, okay? I saw a few in there. Oh, uh, I have not been grabbing those, because... Yeah, just scroll up and grab them. Oh. Right, well. What do they call it? Fingers. I've never seen them fing. Alright, next one. That's just weird. <laughs> one second, let me find another... If a cat... Sh uh, if a cat shed... If a cat sheds later in the year than... than usual, does that make it a deferred payment? God damn it, people. Um, do we yes. have the information? 
Nope, they do. We have to take it. Oh, okay. Where is it? Oh, it's right there? We are the Imperial Navy. At your command. If you could have any vehicle in 40k, which one would it be, and why? Um, probably my battleship. Yeah, I would say an Emperor-class battleship, because I want lots of lances and a Nova Cannon. Initiate emergency repairs. Bad bird. Speaking order. of, I certainly hope they are the Emperor class too. Holy yeah, shit, my yeah, one ship just got game. messed up! Or not the, the Emperor, I'm sorry, the Apocalypse class. Enemy ship sighted. The Apocalypse would be amazing yes, to see. <clears throat> the frickin', yeah, because it just has tons of lances and a Nova Cannon. Changing it's just course. awesome. I mean, if they're adding the Crags Honor, I don't know the reason why they wouldn't have the Holy crap, look what's next to my ship! Helm coordinates acknowledged. Uh, yeah, you've got a battle barge. Awaiting orders. Brace for impact. Oh, what chapter is this? It's skulls Damage on teams. it. Begin repairs now. Ultramarines. Oh. Your command. We should be okay. Orders received. Awaiting orders. My uh, ship's done for, so I'm just gonna have to do a lightning strike to kill this ship. And then it died. That's fine. One of our ships is gone, sir. Get its lances down. Engines on. Get its uh, shields down with your lances. Information down. Okay, got the information. Get out of here, okay. Alexis. I'm actually just gonna try to get past him really quickly. Good idea. If you could just destroy him, that'd be the easiest thing to do. On it. Focus him and keep that battle barge away from me. Oh, and Noogle, grab some questions. I am. I uh, ask them right now. Mm-hmm. Cruising speed set. When are, when are we going to get Epic Titanicus this time, this time around, with specialist games from Games Workshop? Uh, I'm really hoping we get them soon. I kind of expect it to be soon. Oh my god, am, am I really going... Oh, good hit! You turned him perfect! Yeah, that's what was my goal was. No, shit! They got the data! Okay, um, I have a lightning strike. I can take it back. Alright, uh, take it back, because we only have seven seconds. Understood. Execute high energy turn. Working on it. Engine yeah, he's he's already running. Almost there. Information uh, secured. Got it. Cruising speed. All right, we're out. Target locked in. Next question. Yep. Which prime mark would be best in the bedroom? Fulgrim. Yeah, Fulgrim's the slot. I would have said Ross, honestly. Like, not only that, <laughs> Fulgrim has had um, marriages and lovers before. So, Fulgrim kind of has experience. I mean, I can assume that Ross also has experience. I would assume Ross has experience. Oh, your ship died. That's okay. Ah, mine didn't. I'm okay with that, because if it hit that, it would have died. And I mean, I see your point. Fulgrim might be a slut, but... But I mean, Lehman Russ is a dog. Alright, do you want to call that there? Yeah, call we can call it, it here. There. there we go, I can speak, I promise. Oh, there was one last question. All right, let's get the last one. If electricity comes from electrons, does morality come from morons? <laughs> That's the true strength of the Imperium. Oh my god. Anyway, guys, I want to thank you for checking out this live stream. It's a lot of fun. We still have a ton of questions to go through. 
Um, I want to thank Mo and Nubel for helping me out once again and joining me for another live stream. It is always great to have you guys. And yeah, from there, I'm just going to say be sure, be sure to check out Mope's uh, painting streams and her channel. Link will be in the description down below for those of you who are watching that after this. I'm probably just going to add you as a permanent upload to my uh, descriptions and everything. Okay, that sounds good to me. But I would appreciate it for everyone who comes and takes a look. She just painted up the Lady of Depravity, and now she's moving on to a more converted model. It looks beautiful, by the way. If you like gigantic banners, come check it out. Because this banner is... It's the biggest banner you've ever seen. It's the bigliest. It is the hugest banner. Anyway, it's guys. With that, I'm going to say love you guys. Bye. This is.